Happy New Year's. Welcome 2019. This is the Global Stock Investor Show. Welcome, Global Investors. I mean, as you can see, it's the first day of 2019. I'm amped up. I just got a little allergies. I was going to postpone it until tomorrow, but I mean, practice makes perfect. So uh, that's why I'm jumping on this because I still, I mean, I have content for for years. So pretty much I'm doing this on a daily basis for me um, to get better at this and to share, share my journey with you guys. Um, it's been uh, the fourth. This Friday will be the fourth of January. Will be one year that I've been a global investor, which started, as you can see here. So that's when I started. Uh, this is what it's looking like today. I'm da um, down two hundred and eleven dollars, um, which is like negative three point eighty two. As you can see, this is where I'm at. About five thousand. 321 and 51 cents um, as of now my stocks that I that I'm holding as you can see I'm scrolling down to the right I am at 68 so I mean I finished the year off awesome I hit I went over the 50 because my goal was every year obtain 50 companies but I see that I'm gonna hit my goal of 100 before the summer and then I'm going to have to do another 50 again. So, or I might even bump it up to 100, but I like, you know, hitting 50. So when I hit 50, you know, I pretty much, I'm going to do throw, throw a party for myself. You know, I'm, I'm going down. As you can see, my range of companies that I buy from 1,000 all the way down to a dollar. So there you have it. Uh, today, I'm going to be going over the, the energy sector, part 12, and this will be the last last part in the energy sector. Tomorrow, this should be interesting. Uh, tomorrow, I'll be starting the, the technology sector, and there's 12 parts to that. So today, I got six energy companies to give you guys. Unfortunately, um, any of you guys are big into dividends, um, as I'm looking at my... My chart, this these six energy companies that I'm gonna give to you, there they have no dividend yield. So, I mean, I'm just giving you guys, you know, for beginning, beginning. I mean, this this pretty much journey is from somebody that has no idea how to, you know, how the stock market operates. But um, I'm pretty much like on on perspective of the. Of investing in the market I'm not one of those types where I look at all the well I look at numbers but I pretty much look look at buying companies so I mean that's pretty much my strategy is building the foundation first so I think um, once I get my first 500 companies then I'll start doubling up on the shares once I because what I want to do each day is look at um, what do you call it the <clears throat> The history, the pretty much what, okay, as you can see, okay, this is pending. They usually show like uh, the dividends. So really what I'm paying attention to more, more and more, they, uh, monthly is pretty much the dividends that which companies pay the most dividends. You know, as you can see, I'm expecting dividends from Walmart on the second um, dividend. A dividend from Disney on the 10th and then plus you know I got I mean 68 companies and not all of them are dividends because I believe in some companies in their growth so I mean as you can see my stocks and options they're at um, 4,900 uh, cash on hand is about 400 so and that's pretty much uh, this cash I'm, I'm holding I'm trying to get it I want to buy a share of Amazon so once I buy that, I have uh, fame completed, which is Facebook, Amazon, Apple, Netflix, and then Google, which is Alphabet. So, and then just to have that, and pretty much um, my my son, 
you know, I'm teaching him about investing. So pretty much, I'm pretty much buying him more of the um, more tech stocks, um, knowing that the U.S. and China are pretty much big on uh, technology in the world. They're leaders in it. So I mean, I'll go over that tomorrow. All the the different uh, companies. Um, once I hit a hundred, a hundred stocks that I pers that uh, my company owns, I'll start going over. I'll break that my hundred companies down into parts, and I'll go from top to bottom, so highest to lowest, and I'll give you guys five a day, and then I'll go from there. Okay, let's get into this energy sector, part 12. Uh, the first energy company is Enphase Energy. In, okay, Enphase Energy. Go to the five-year. Baseline, market price, about $5. About, Enphase Energy Incorporated engages in the design, development, manufacture, and sale of microinverter systems for the solar photovoltaic industry. Its products include IQ7 microinverter series, IQ battery, IQ envoy, IQ microinverter accessories, IQ envoy accessories, and Enlighten and Apps. The company was founded by Reg Halver R. Belur and Martin Fornage in March 2006 and is headquartered in Pet Petaluma, California. Uh, the current CEO, wow. I'm going to try to get, give this a shot. <laughs> Bad Rin uh, Rayanin Kot, Kot and Dar Daraman, wow. Employees, 336. Headquarters, Petaluma, California. Founded in 2006. Market cap, 502.90 million. Dividend yield, zero. Buy 86%, hold 14%, those two together more than 75%. That's the first energy company. The second energy company is Vinvent Solar. Just gonna look at the five year. As you can see, it's baseline. Market price about $4. About the Vivint Solar Incorporated engages in the provision of residential solar. It also designs and installs solar energy systems and offers monitoring and maintenance services. The company is founded by Alexander J. Dunn, Todd R. Peterson, and Tang Tangai Vincent Sierra. Sarah on August 12, 2001, and is headquartered in Lehigh, Utah. The current CEO is David H. Bywater, employees 2,322, headquarters Lehigh, Utah, founded in 2011, market cap 454.59 million, dividend yield zero. Okay, so that's the second energy company. The third energy company is Chesapeake Chesapeake Energy. I currently own two shares, as you can see. Um, let's go to the five-year. As you can see, baseline, uh, market price, $2. This, this stock was given to me by Robinhood. I, uh, what was it? I recommended... Uh, this brokerage account, what uh, Robinhood to other people, so I got two. Robinhood gave me a gift, so it was this. This, this company was from Robinhood. About Chesapeake Energy Corp engages in acquisition, exploration, and development of properties for the production of oil, natural gas, and natural gas liquids from underground reservoirs. It focuses on projects located in Louisiana, Ohio. Oklahoma, Pennsylvania, Texas, and Wyoming. The company was founded by Aubrey K. McClendon and Thomas L. Ward on May 18, 1989, and is headquartered in Oklahoma City, Oklahoma. 
The current CEO is Doug Lawler, employees 3200 headquarters, Oklahoma City, Oklahoma, founded in 1989. Market cap 1.91 billion, dividend yield zero. Buy 13%, hold 52%. Um, those two together, it doesn't make 75%, but that's, you know, this company was given to me. So, I mean, as you can see, $2, I mean, the choice is yours. And this is all for beginning, oh, excuse me. This is all for beginning investors. So these companies right here, you you throw two dollars away on you know on pretty much your daily living. And versus you know just to get the feel. I mean, look what two dollars is. Two dollars that you put into a company, the market cap on that. You know, even though it's not paying a dividend yield. So and that's how I kind of gauge stuff now. Like I I like every penny of mine's to work for me, like an employee would. So, and that's how I look at it. So, if I see a penny on the ground, I'll pick it up because I know I could put it put it into Robin Hood and buy companies and, and have it work for me. Just having that mindset helps me out a lot. Okay, the fourth energy company is Dunbury. Uh, this is another uh, company that Robin Hood uh, gifted to me. I got two shares of... Dunbury, as you can see, when I first got it, it was um, about three dollars. Now you can see it's like a uh, dollar sixty-nine. Let's look at the five-year baseline. Dollar sixty-nine. About Denbury, Denbury Resources Incorporated, also called Denbury, is an independent oil and natural gas company. Its activities include exploitation, drilling, and extraction. It operates in the Gulf Coast and Rocky Mountain regions. The company was founded by Gareth R. Roberts in 1951 and is headquartered in Plano, Texas. The current CEO is Christian S. Kendall. Employees, 879. Headquarters, Plano, Texas. Founded in 1951. Market cap, 787. Point fifty seven million dividend yield zero hold seventy five percent buy eight percent those two together more than seventy five percent and like I said it's a dollar sixty nine um, but this company was gifted to me by Robert Hood for recommending their their app to other other people uh, the fifth energy company is China. Recycling energy. Let's go to the five year. As you can see, it's been baselining since the beginning. Market price about 73 cents. It's global stock investing right here. China Recycling Energy Corp. Excuse me, manufactures energy. Saving ballist, ballast and related equipment. Its operations are carried out through the following recovery systems. Blast furnace, top, gas recovery, turbine unit, cement, low temp heat, power generation, waste gas power generation, combined cycle power plant, and biomass waste power generation. The TRT utilizes high pressure gas emitted from the steel blast furnace and converts the, the pressured energy into mechanical energy to drive the turbine units and generate electricity. The CHPG collects and utilizes medium to low temperature wasted steam and gas emitted from production process of the cement rot rotary cleans to generate electricity. The WGPG utilizes flammable waste gas emitted from coal mining petroleum exploitation and refinery processing as a fuel source to generate electricity. The CCPP generates electricity by burning previously released gas generated during the iron making process of blast furnaces. The BW 
WPG utilizes high pressure gas emitted from the furnace that burns biomass waste such as, such as wood, straw, rice straw, rice husk, and biogases, and then converts energy into mechanical energy to drive the turbines and generate electricity. Huh, interesting. China Recycling Energy was founded by Gu Hao Ku in May 20, 2004 and is headquartered in Xi'an, China. The current CEO is Gu Hao Ku, employees 27, headquartered Xi'an Xiao Xinix, founded 2004, market cap 6.13 million, dividend yield zero. Okay, that's the fifth energy company. Last but not least, and this will close out the energy sector, is Sunwork. Okay, let's go to the five year. Uh, I own a share of Sunwork. Uh, the market price is 26 cents. About Sunworks Incorporated engages in the provision of photovoltaic based power systems for the residential, commercial, and agricultural and agricultural markets. Its services include design, system engineering, procurement, project install, installation, construction, grid connection, warranty, system monitoring, and maintenance. The company was founded by Roland F. Bryan, Mark P. Harris, and Christopher T. Cle Cleveland in 1983 and is headquartered in Roseville, California. The current CEO is Chuck Cargill, Employees, 2009, headquarters, Roseville, California, founded in 1983, market cap, 6.83 million, dividend yield, zero. And that will complete the energy sector, and that's all part 12. If you want to go through uh, the energy sector, um, I have videos from part 1 to part 12, which I have five companies, the last Part 11 and 12, I gave you guys six. And tomorrow, I'll be going over technology sector. So it'd be part one. In conclusion, subscribe to the channel. Comment any questions or recommendations you have. Like if the content was inspiring for you. And share this information with other global stock investors. While you're slaying dragons... I'll be taming them.